Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to hopefully resolve the issue with your desktop Windows Manager resulting in high memory usage. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward tutorial and without further ado, let's jump right into it. So basically the DWM executable just stands for Desktop Windows Manager. So this is generally used with visual effects that are going on with your desktop. So different windows, frames, resolution, animations that may appear on your screen. That's basically what we're dealing with in this situation. So hopefully I'm going to show you guys a quick way to how to resolve it. So the first thing I would suggest would be to go ahead and change the desktop wallpaper to a default windows wallpaper. So I'm going to just right click on our desktop and then left click on personalize. Now you can go ahead, I would personally suggest trying one of the default Windows ones and see if that resolves the issue. And then just close out of here once you're done. And hopefully that would work. I would suggest restarting your computer as well. And then go ahead and try putting your old wallpaper back on and see if that was the cause. Now if that was not the cause, we can go ahead and go underneath screensaver and I'd personally try and go ahead and disable that. So we're going to start by opening up the start menu, type in screensaver. Best match should come back with change screensaver, left click on that. Underneath screensaver you want to set it to none and then left click on apply and OK. Let's just restart your computer as well, see if that's resolved the problem. And I mean hopefully that would have resolved the issue at this point. And the next thing I would actually suggest would be to open up the start menu and go ahead and type in command prompt. One of the best managers should come back with command prompt. You want to right click on that and then left click on run as administrator. If you receive a user account control prompt you want to left click on yes. Now I'm going to have a command pasted in the description of the video. I want you guys to copy it and then go up to the top bar of the command prompt, right click and left click edit and then left click on paste. Once you paste it in, it should run here for a second and it will open up the performance troubleshooter. So find and fix problems to help optimize Windows speed and performance. Left click on the advanced button right here and make sure it's set to apply repairs automatically. Left click on next. This will take a moment to run so please be patient. So on some newer versions of Windows, you're not going to be able to run this, but if you're on Windows 7 or Windows 8, you probably would be able to find a little bit more success with it. But I thought it was worth a shot, so that's why I included it. So I'm going to just close out of here. Again, with just restarting your computer, and hopefully the problem has been resolved. So as always, thank you for watching. I do hope I was able to help you out, and I look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.